it's already quite polluted and if we don't save the planet it will become wrecked so we have to stand up for our rights and try and uh, do as much as possible sometimes i feel like what well, if we do destroy this planet we only have one but then i can always make myself feel better that we are all doing little things Solar for Schools helps schools get solar panels. It helps schools get low cost solar energy at zero capital cost to the schools. Our goal is just to help as many schools across the UK get solar as we can, and that's why we're here. Today we're here at Spinfield Primary School in Marlow, Buckinghamshire. Welcome to Spinfield Primary School. This was my old primary school and it means a lot to me because I know a lot of people made my friends here and it's just a nice place to come. Spinfield Primary School is a small school. It's got 210 pupils. It's a one-form entry school. And like any state school right now, we have really limited financial resources. Having to manage budgets with, with less money and more cost is, is a worry. The reality is if we haven't got money, we have to make cost savings and the, the first thing that we might have to do is look at reducing the amount of staff members we have in our team and each and every member of our team is absolutely pivotal in our children's education. So we are really reluctant to do that. We were looking at a potential threefold increase in electricity prices. I knew that we had to do something. Solar for Schools were absolutely fantastic to work with. They guided us along each step of the journey. They could do all of the project management was, that was required, get all of the permissions that are required from the council, from the district network operator. It would have been great if we'd been able to raise the money ourselves, but realistically we weren't able to do that in a small school with only 210 pupils with limited income, limited reserves. Solar for Schools and the Community Benefit Society was a way of raising the money. We just felt so supported by Solar for for schools and had every confidence in, in what they were going to do. The idea of being able to use solar panels within schools was a really nice, bright new initiative and made a lot of sense to the school and to the parents who supported it. So we were really excited for the panels to come in. Solar panels were installed July 2022 in the heat wave. Kieran came along with his team. They were absolutely fantastic to work with, worked really safely, really carefully, and engaged with the children really well. So the children were very excited about the solar panels coming in. Binfield Primary has saved a lot of money since getting solar panels. Since we've had the solar panels, we've actually saved about £10,000, which is a great amount of money for our first year of having solar panels. Once I started working with the Solar for Schools team, I realised that they had all of the knowledge, they had a way of raising the money, and that they would also use our solar panels as a tool for education, which was the most important part of all. One of the great things about Solar for Schools is that not only do we put panels on school rooftops, we also provide education in energy and sustainability. That's for the lifetime of the solar systems. We go into the schools and deliver workshops and assemblies. Some people came in and taught us about the solar panels and then the climate and made us understand it more why we were installing the solar panels. Today I'm delivering an assembly at Spinfield. I'm going to be showing them some of the live data that we share with schools that have installations with us. Of course the children, they are so enthusiastic. Projects like this, they just love. I really enjoyed making the solar panel circuits. I've learned that solar panels can take the energy from the sun and use it to help the school. It saves burning fossil fuels. And now we're using solar panels, it's even better. I think it's just so important that they're learning about energy production and they can take that with them as an adult. The children at Spinfield absolutely are committed to, to their environment. If we can inspire them to take a role in environmental activity, then we've done our part in trying to protect the planet. I've taught my mum and dad about solar panels and my grandparents. And I think it will hopefully help them to understand why it's such a big achievement for us and what they can do to the world. I'm really aware that we're in the middle of a cost of living crisis and that people have limited resources. But what I would say is that even if you have a small amount, don't worry if it doesn't feel like that much. Even if you've got a small amount and you feel able and willing to invest in something that makes a genuine difference, 
do it. We're all helping to keep the planet nice and healthy. It keeps it at the forefront that we need to be mindful daily on what we are doing to protect the environment and how our seemingly small contribution is part of a bigger picture. Schools that are thinking about getting solar panels, I think it's definitely a great thing to do. There are no negatives. It's great for the students, they're so involved, but also for the school. You're gonna save a ton of money and you're doing something great for the environment. There's really no reason not to go ahead and do it. I hope that the whole planet will be incredible and that we can all live a happy life. Solar for schools for all schools.